half back towards half forward. Barry falls off the oh, contest. Johnson came in from the side and took a very clever mark. And half minutes left in this third term. The Lions lead by six points. Chance for Mackey. Young man in a hurry across to Johnson. Quick snap, kicks a goal. <laughs> Scores a level. Now, looks up, has rock on it, centre half forward. The kick needs to be good. It was just a bit blunt, oh. but a big play there. And Steve Johnson got across in front of Rocker. That was courage. Inside the forward 50 for the Cats. Johnson, can he conjure up another one? Wheels around. Yeah, Drop punt on the way is there. Wojcicki with a big shepherd. Dean Fair, what a beauty. Carlton, they will end up with a footy. DeLuca for Walker. The Waldo set up. Steve Johnson unloads from 50. Long kick. Great goal. Ling from Gardner. Here's Ablett. Breaks the tackle. Takes them on. The look away handball was magnificent. Flying shot at the goal. There's an absolute beauty. Johnson's got another one. The look away handball from Ablett was mesmerising. And Johnson kicks goal number three. Their forward 50 in the last five minutes. And they under, are under extreme pressure. And it's come through the tackling and harassment by the Geelong forwards. 14 to 2 inside 50, favouring the Cats. King, Steve Johnson, hard up against the line. Snap, go and bouncing, bouncing. An inspiring goal from Stephen Johnson. Two down there, working his way to the front was Johnson. Couldn't take the mark. Hay at the back tight, he's up, head straight for the line. Deliberate. So a chance for the Cats. Through Steve Johnson. Right on the fence. Can be a bit of a lottery, those ones, Jared. the deliberates. I don't think there was too much doubt in that one. It was a good decision by the umpire, and that's a good kick. That is a brilliant kick. Steve Johnson from the fence has popped it through. That has a kick. Try marking that one. Oh. Oh. Johnson, and he doesn't look well, and it's not surprising. Good play. King went the risky grab out of the ruck work. Chance now for Johnson. Oh, he's clean up stand. And got the kick and kick the goal. He's a freak. One for the hard way. Got it. Worth the risk by big Steve King. He's up against Kepler Bradley, an undersized ruckman, and King has been doing the craft for so long. He may as well have a go at it, but he just knew. absorbs the punishment here. You knew when Johnson picked the footy up, something's going to happen. 12 metres out from goal, that something would happen. That's the sort of player he is. He was gun cold here, Stephen Johnson, but he's such a mercurial type, he still, most players would have fallen over. Back to play fair, Chapman wants the right foot, knows where they are. Pops it up to the goal square. Chance for the leapers. Almost Steve Johnson tried to rake it in. Toe pokes it up the deck. Rolls it towards goal. That is a <laughs> that's miracle. It. That's it. <laughs> How could he kick that? That's the goal of the season. Now I reckon somewhere in Victoria, Peter Dacos is watching right now and he would look at that, nod his head and say, gee, I like this boy. Not bad. Hey, this guy's got some. Tapped it away, Kelly. He's lost it, Chapman tries to keep his feet. Steve Johnson does keep his feet. Oh, that's unbelievable! Steve Johnson, one of the goals of the... Selwood just pokes it towards full forward. Steve Johnson's down there and almost marks it. Kicks the goal regardless. He is the miracle man. Well, gee, wasn't a great handball, really to no one. Steve Johnson somehow got it to Corey. Good handball back to Steve Johnson. He's deep in the pocket. Can he get onto the left foot and snap a goal? Yes, he can! <laughs> Plenty of depth, it's all set up for Stevie Johnson. And Hutto, that's because Wojcicki backed himself. He could have just bombed away, but he, he was prepared to use his pace and sidestep an opponent. He's coming off the ground now, but that was just bold football. And Stevie Johnson almost made a fool of the man of the mark, puts it through for a goal. It's the wing, Ling, now Bartell. Inside the forward 50, Steve Johnson. Clever oh. mark. <laughs> well, he conceded front spot. That's not a lot in it, but you have to pay it the way that interpretation is. Yes, I think it was uh, a free to the letter of the law. Steve Johnson, surely not from there. Surely <laughs> oh, not. Only one man in the world could do it. It's Steve Johnson.
Johnson, and he's got up four. Handed off with here's Gary Ablett, runs to 55, kicks towards Mooney. Well done, Richards. Johnson, brilliant! Not yeah, too sure where he needs to kick on his left foot there. Exactly. Chapman to Johnson, no stopping him there. He's going to bend it back for oh. considerable oh. range, and he measures it off to perfection in game number 100. He lets fly now. Oh, Steve Johnson. He's not it, but he can't. Selwood goes over the top. There's one of them, and there's the other, Scarlett. Kick from Corey, down towards the pocket, tracking at Johnson. Johnson, a pretty difficult kick from there, but not for him. Lovely goal. A scramble about 30 metres out from Geelong's goal. Ricochets across towards oh! Johnson, and Johnson has kicked their 11th of the corner. Sling to Bartell. To half forward. Powell was a little bit unlucky there. It was a hard one to trap. Oh. Steve Johnson with oh. immaculate skill. Just brilliant skill. And he might get a goal himself. He does his sin, but brought it straight to Corey and Steve Johnson. Johnson. Two goals beside his name. And it's a lovely oh. kick. A magnificent kick. And, uh, it's Mike Pike, actually. Yeah. Johnson screws the ball around the body for number five. He's got it. Against Collingwood. He goes Ling. Johnson is there and he did it beautifully. And Daniel Mel Menzel puts through his six for the year. If he was any cooler, he would have done a bit of oh. a oh, what a mark that is! Johnson with a different opponent in Richards. Stevie J, he started in the centre square and before the umpire bounced it, he sprinted to full forward. And right to Ling. Ling measures into the pocket and the kick finds Johnson. And if anyone can kick a goal from here. He's going to kick around the corner from 45 metres out. It's coming back. You are a genius, Steve Johnson. Perfect hand pass. Gives Stokes a second chance. Heppel, Chapman with him. Chapman to Pudsey Adley. Little knock on. Oh. Johnson. Oh. 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 Just catches an unbelievable goal. He's kicked two in a minute. Oh. The cats are coming. He is a genius, that man on screen there. Have a look at him. How about even attempting this? Look at that. Lands on his back. No one else would even have any understanding that you could actually possibly pull that off. Bartell, they open it up, the Cats here. Now Bartell, careful kick. Johnson was clever. Turns Schofield inside out. Stevie Johnson goes bang. And oh, oh. Yep, he kicks the goal. Duncan in a 1-2 with Selwood. Inside 50 to Johnson, free. Who's playing on this one? Good tap, Scott. Unfortunately, he's just getting caught. Go sideways. He's a bit too smart. Well, look at this. Oh, you cannot do that. Leisurely kick. And it's oh. for him. No way. You cannot do that. That is not on Stevie J. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. One step. Big man. He turned on a five cent piece. Selwood out of the middle. And speaking of turning, this game has suddenly turned. Ottens won't get to the contest. Johnson will. Johnson! Uh, around the corner, suckers another one. How about this? Three goals. To Just outside 50. He squeezes that short. And Stevie J. Talk us through it, Tom. What's he thinking? <laughs> well, he's thinking he wants a better result than what he had last time. So go the check side here. He goes the check side, starts it out left, brings it back right. Beautifully called Tom Harley and beautifully finished Stevie J. They've had three or four chances this quarter and just haven't quite pulled. That was good though by Duncan and Johnson and Johnson. It's a good baby powder. <laughs> Moment. 43 seconds to go. Off hands off, oh, Stevie Johnson, the party trick, Stevie just to end the day on a high note. He's got his goal, little skip in the air as well. And a skip in his step for this magician, this superstar of the game. This handball is a beauty, in right on the overlap, here they go. Stevie J from 51 metres out, on the turn, lines them up and puts it right through the middle.
right on the dot in the middle of the goal. By Hodge to Suckling now, Suckling, the vision, well, pressure, well done, Blitzard. Well, there's one athlete that was up for Hill, eh? And then Blitzard's going wide to the pocket. Well, I was going to say, not sure about that, but then I saw who got it and who comes around. Yes, he does, and gets the first of what might be a few for Stevie J today. That mark came from the, uh, the suckling skillers. You, you just noticed skill there was so much because you're only going to have one about every five or ten minutes. You, you, you. Good double up lead. And he can get it to Johnson. Let's see what Stevie's first contribution will be. It's not bad. <laughs> oh, how about that off your left? But this has become a problem very early in the piece for the West Coast Eagles, and that is the form of Blitzarves. He looks like he's going head to head with the Brownlow medalist, and he's beating him for pace into their forward line. He's making Prittis defend. Now Gretchen, the man BT mentioned, really hasn't been sighted. Gathered that one nicely, though. So better transition play at the back, Stevie J. Has he got the leg speed to pick it up and get away from Stratton? He's going to take him on, Stevie. Game number 250, left foot stab. He's still got it. But no chance in game 250. This was always going to be not, a goal to Stevie. Not in 250. You, you go, and he knows he can finish those. I love this here, Richo. So just giving uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sammy Mitchell a little tap what, what as he that? went past. Oh, gee, that's important. Stepped around the mark. Here's Stevie J lurking dangerously. Picked it up in the one motion beautifully. Left foot snap from Stevie. There it is. He's a genius, Stevie. Walked back in, Gordon. It opened up this whole side of the ground here. And Stevie J, he reads the play as quick as anyone. He's and the it, first person to realise, and what a finish, Lingy. And he is one of the most competitive blokes alive. And the reason he made sure he kicked that was because of the simple one that he missed about three or four minutes ago. That's have had 20 more handball receives than the Crows, so a lot more running and linking. Stevie Johnson through the pack. This time, this man has left his signature on this ground in so many different ways over the years. That's a miracle goal. That was his best. The degree of Dougaly, that's the reason he kicked it, because that was the toughest shot he's yeah. had thus far. That was the best of the day. He had to run oh, through man. a bit of traffic. He hits the clearance at speed and just takes it on the run, carves a sway through it. A couple he's, of them, and then the snap is brilliant. He's angry, Jase. Mumford hooks it down. Bond and Pelly, big man, hard to bring down. Gets a hand pass towards Johnson. Not his intention. Johnson has hooked oh, no. a magnificent goal. <laughs> Cameron's best against the Bulldogs is five. That was around 12, around five, rather 2012. Stevie Johnson, we've seen him pick one from a unlikely situation already. Make it two, Stevie J. He knows how to kick a goal. Wilson scrambles it towards the top of the square. Henderson with the big fist from four deep. Here's Stevie J on cue. Oh. Knows where they are. Can you believe it? Who writes this script? <laughs> What about that, Derm? That was just pure footy right there. Stevie J at his best. Look at Colin Jasney just on the back of the pack now. Yeah. He started shoulder to shoulder when that ball was in flight. That's right. Oh, he puts the hand on the head. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let's see. Johnson oh. got it anyway. <laughs> oh, he's watch out. He's got the Ooslars again, Stevie. Forever the entertainer. Of no prior opportunity. Cleverly played. Stevie's going to claim this one. Surely, how could he get it through there? He has! Throw, throwing ball up last week from that exact spot. I reckon it's the goal of the season so far. He, he laid it across the body off two steps. and Not enough people spoke about it. Yeah. He is so good at that sort of stuff. Off one to two steps in motion. That's very clever. But how nobody was anywhere near him is beyond me. Well, the front position. He gets him involved. Lob trying to fight it at his feet. He did get a kick away. It spills to Stevie J. Off the left boot. Loves this situation. And Steve Johnson kicks a great goal. That was a really nice piece of work. Just holds his width here, sits out of the contest, doesn't get sucked in. And just a couple of steps, as easy as you like, on the left slipper. And that is straight through and very cheekily just goes back to his teammates. Well, he torched Kelly. Kelly wanted it. Gave it over to Stevie J. He won't be giving this one off, Stevie. Up and under. Now, Lob fisted away from him. Coming through. Stevie's got it back again. Little dash, Gimme. And then Stevie's kicked it, I think.
No, there's a correct hit. through for a goal? Yeah, all clear. All clear. Stevie J kicks his first, and it's the Giants in the lead. This is good play because he kicked it, Richo. He did. Look at that. Oh, still a bit of agility in the old boy, Stevie. Oh, what, a, what, that one. what about the right-hand pick up there? That was sensational. Yeah. He just hunts the ball at ground level, which is great for a ruckman. Scully on the not preferred. Stevie J sums it up. I think he likes his chances, Stevie. That's the sort of goal that he kicks. Oh. He's a freak. <laughs> what a genius. One of the great goals. Well, this is one of the goals of the year. Stevie J looked inside, nothing on there. Jeremy Cameron, you're not close enough. I'm going to go yeah. up myself. Close to the line again, Rampy. Stevie J from the pocket. Oh, what a time for it. If you've got it, flaunt it. And Stevie has. So you get that kick in the middle 90 seconds ago. <laughs> and then you see him do that. And you just think, is this the same player? It's We've funny. seen it for hundreds and hundreds of games, literally. They come back with interest, you would think. There it is, a Wilson kick. Stevie! Oh, he's done it beautifully! So I battled hard in the last couple of weeks to have this opportunity, but I've just been outplayed tonight, right from the first bounce. Stevie picked it up, he's sensing an opportunity to score another one. A left foot bender, Stevie's got another goal! He's got three this quarter. Yeah, as Dars mentioned earlier, Brett Deledio missed both of the games the Giants played against the Tigers. So next week, his first game against the his old side, Stevie J. Stevie J. <laughs> Number six.